Hey guys, Koopa Koopa Blooper here, and welcome back to more Mario & Luigi Superstar Saga. So in this episode, we are going to be facing, we're not going to be facing, um, Kakaletta, but we're going to be going to where she is. Anyway, if you go in here, you can get some items. I'm kind of useful, I mean, there's nothing really too great, but I mean, there's still some extra stuff you can get, so... I'm so frightened at the thought of Kakaletta being in here that I refuse to leave. Can't make me. <laughs> is Queen Bean safe? I don't know, let's go check, because... They told us not to dot dwaddle, even though we waited like two weeks to upload. And for that, I do kind of apologize. It's just been... Soccer has been moved to five days a week now, Monday through Friday. And as well, I've been driving with the instructor the past couple days, so I've had like no time to do anything. Oh, we're too late. The bean star. <laughs> the bean star and Princess Peach's voice are already mine. Once we awaken the Beanstar with Peach's voice, the world would be Kakletta's snack cake. Say, Mario Bros, you haven't bothered to pay a visit to your host, Queen Bean. I thought you had better manners, wouldn't you agree, Queen Bean? Perhaps the three of you can sit down over tea and discuss the finer points of the foreign policy. <laughs> and Queen Bean has been, is like this huge, muscular, creepy lady. Anyway, Queen Bean is probably one of the hardest bosses in the game. Um, what you're supposed to do is if you just jump on her head, um, you'll actually take damage. You're supposed to jump on her arms. And her arms, I forget. I don't really know how much HP her arms have, but... There is one thing you can do to make this fight really easy, which I highly recommend you do. <coughs> oh, man, jeez. Coming down with a cough or something. Anyway, if you use Advanced Splash Brothers on her head, this boss fight will be so easy, it's sort of pathetic. So that'll be do 26 damage. Um, you can't do this with- you can only do it with Mario though, so... I kinda wanna do this boss fight the right way. Cause I don't wanna take her out. I mean, I don't wanna- I don't wanna kill her without- crap! Okay. I don't wanna kill her without her showing off like all her moves and stuff. So I'm gonna do this the right way. Unfortunately, I need some more syrup. Good thing we got some in that, um, area before. Uh, let's see. Let's syrup Mario. Alright, good thing. The good thing we got ten syrups. <laughs> um, also, during this boss fight, you might realize that I'm not using the sidebars. I'm just trying to see how... I just kind of want to look at how it, lo how, the, uh, how it looks without the sidebars and stuff. Because I wanted to... I don't know. I'm trying out new stuff. Why did I... That was an epic fail. Oh, uh, let's see, her arm should be just about done, too. Alright, <laughs> there we go. And her arm, like, oh, fudge, man. Jeez, man. Lucky 10, alright, that was good. Anyway, when both her arms are done, her crown will fall off, and she'll start spitting beans at you. Now, if you jump on the beans, they will turn into those little beanie guys. So, but the good thing is, the most you can have is four people on a field four enemies on the field, so once you get more than three, they're just gonna, they're just gonna keep going, they won't, like, turn into beanies. My advice to you, just ignore the beanies, they're completely, like, they're not a threat at all, trust me. Because this is the main, this is the main attacking point where you can attack Queen Bean, so. I remember when I first played this game for the first time, I mean, if you don't have advanced Splash Brothers and you're and you're doing an all HP let's play like mine, this fight might take like 10 minutes or so. So after this, I'm gonna start attacking her with when she has the crown on, which will make this fight a lot easier. So yeah, I mean, this fight is actually pretty difficult. All right, good. As you can see, once you just like just keep defending these beanie guys, I mean, you'll eventually just kill them by jumping on them. Crap, I'm running out of... I'm running out of... Oh, fudge, man. We need to heal up. I didn't realize how low they were on HP. Crap. Uh, where's the nut at? Alright. These will heal us up 20 each. And I gotta say, these beanie guys are so easy now. And she'll regain her arm strength. She takes her steroids to get her arms back up to full strength. Full power! And when she does that, she kills the beanie guys, so... Now we can just destroy her head now. Because we have advanced, advanced Splash Brothers. Yeah, let's see. Mario needs more syrup. Whee! 
All right, now she got to do the attack again. This, is, this, if you get hit by this, it's pretty devastating. So definitely, do you do not want to get hit by that? Anyway, she should be just about. Ah, oh, fudge. Yeah, if you fail, yeah, if you fail, you're you fail. You're not gonna do any damage to her. So I kind of just wasted a turn there, but oh well. Oh man, don't want to get hit by that. Trust me, it's devastating. All right, let's time this right. A. A, A, yeah, perfect. And boom, she's gone just like that. Now the fight probably would have taken twice as long if I if I didn't have advanced, advanced Splash Brothers. So anyway, Luigi leveling up to level eight, very nice. All right, man, we're getting pretty high on HP. Nice. Oh no, Kekla had a Force Queen being to eat the Belly Black Worm. <clears throat> That's what turned her into this. Our fair kingdom is doomed. Doomed! How will we ever return Queen Bean to normal? Well, what's that you say? The Mario Bros will do something about it? <laughs> what can you possibly mean? You speak of the impossible! Why, there is no known way to spit out and ingest the Belly, belly Black. Well, except there is that way, that last resort. It sure isn't pretty, though. She may be able to spit it up. She drank the legendary Chocola Reserve from the Chuckle Huck Woods. <clears throat> You'll go to Chuckle Huck Woods? You'll find the Chocola Reserve? Well, if you're going to make such a bold proclamations, I suppose you have no choice but to rely on you. Take this Bean Bean Brooch and head southward from the castle toward Chateau de Chuckle Huck. Luigi's just spoken her. <laughs> if you find the Chocola Reserve hidden deep in the Chuckle Hulk Woods, our queen may yet recover. You got the Bean Bean Brooge. Alright, let's go. Let's see, what what does Queen Bean have to say? Dot, dot, dot. Okay. Let's go. So if we head out to the castle, we're actually going to have a small... Wait, hold on, is this door open? No, it's not. Dang it. And we're gonna have a small cutscene that's actually really useful to us. As soon as we leave, once we hit right here. Mario, Luigi! Lady Lima has asked that you also take this along with you. You got a bean badge. The thing is, that thing is a badge. If you equip it, you'll be a little stronger in battle. Different badges have different effects, so... For now, if you get a badge, make sure you equip it. To equip a badge, press select on your suitcase. Which is X on the GameCube controller. To equip badges, select this icon. Here you can see the gear and the badge you equipped with. Okay, Mario, time to equip the badge I just gave you. Select this icon. This is where all the badges you, you have are shown. Normally, you'd pick up a badge. It's simple this time since you only have one right now. Press A to equip it. And boom. Now you're all set. Good luck, and be careful. Uh, I'm sorry, Luigi, but you, if you want your own badge, you have to go buy one at the store. <laughs> anyway, what I highly recommend you do, since there is a much better badge you can get right now that'll boost up your stats a little bit better, is there's a different kind of badge you get, which is right in here. Excuse me. Alright. Only ones who still worry about fashion despite the town's crisis are real celebrities. I have a set price that won't dis discredit this place as a high-class boutique. So, uh, what do you guys want to do? Grand of no, we're going to buy. First thing we're going to do is we're going to buy the castle badge. Or, I mean, here's the castle badge that'll... It lowers your BP um, a, a little bit lower than... Anyway, the P badge is much better. So I highly recommend you buy one for Mario. And then you buy one for Luigi. And then you can see what hot fashions they have. Um bean trousers, wow. Um, I'm going to equip this with Mario right now because he's got a little less HP than, 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 than uh, Luigi does. Anyway, and what we're going to do next is we're going to sell the stuff that we don't have equipped right now. We're going to sell the bean badge and the work pants. Um, let's see, hold on. Do we have enough money to buy another one of those trousers? No, we don't. Alright. So anyway, our stats are going to be a lot higher now, so it's really good. Concerning where we're going, we're going to have, you know, higher HP, higher stat, enemies and stuff. Okay, yeah. Okay, I already read what that guy had to say. 
Anyway, um, our stats completely good. Let me look. Yeah, we're a fully. Or, well, we're for the most part, we're fully. I mean, healed. Close enough, anyway. Anyway, we're going to head south, and wow, this game is, like, so bright on my GameCube screen. Holy crap. Oh, new enemy, new enemy, new enemy. These are called para... Um, oh my gosh, it did a lot. Man, that was devastating. Yeah, para beanie. As you can see, the jump just did 10. Which is pretty... Pretty... It was a lot more effective than what we've been doing, so... Crap, this is pretty effective. Okay. It is super effective. Uh, speaking of super effective, I'm actually almost done with Pokemon Leaf Green that I just, um, bought a couple weeks ago. Unfortunately, I'm, like, really low-leveled, and I'm on to, like, the last Elite Four, and I don't have... I have, like, no revives left, and I only have, like, five people on my team that are still alive, so... I'm kind of screwed there, but oh well. I don't know about Pokemon, this is freaking Mario and Luigi. Best game in the universe. Travel here is permitted only by select individuals in order to guard the Chuckle Woods ecology. Oh, that Bean Bean Brooch. That marks special guest of the Bean Bean Castle. Very well then, we shall permit you to enter these woods. Boom. We hope you will enjoy a taste of the incredibly full flavored Chocola Cola while you are here. You know, I'd hate to have these guys' job. I mean, they pretty much just stand here. They can't really leave. Because, I mean, it's like a... I don't know if they can, like, survive this high of a fall. I mean, they probably could, but anyway. Let's just keep going. Uh, run. Oh, man. I freaking hate beanies. And I hate those spiny dudes. Yeah, anyway, let's see. Ah, oh, crap. I kind of want to test out how strong our... <sighs> Our Splash Brothers is now an advanced Splash Brothers. Boom! 68! Oh fudge. That was pretty awesome. 68 damage right there. This early in the game this is pretty good. Alright, let's just keep going. And we've made it to... Um, gosh. We've made it here. Bean Bean... Brewing Chocola Cola, step one. The main ingredient of the Chocola is Cola is the Chocola, Chocola fruit, which grows only in Chuckle Hook Woods. There's so many chuckles. I have chuckles. Or no, it's I have chortles from a Bowser's Inside Story. Alright, step two. Place one Chocola fruit in the barrel that's been filled with the, to the brim with savory syrup. Step three: the funny jokes to the f tell funny jokes to the fruit until it laughs, releasing soda bubbles deep within the when it's brew. Step four: bear in mind that the quality of both the fruit and the jokes will affect the brewing process. Father of Chocola Cola, first generation tattoo owner Bubbles. So that seems to be owner of these chuckle hook stuff. And hey, let's save real quick. And I think that's gonna be enough for this episode. We took down Queen Bean and we've made it to here. Chatu, we made it to Chatu de Chucklehuck. And in the next episode, we'll just move on. So see you guys then, and goodbye.